and I am talking let us get started create a new folder wherever you want to create just create it node.js resume pdf ok open your visual studio code does not matter which operating system you are using whether it is Linux or Microsoft Windows actually it does not matter click on fly a file at folder to workspace note resume builder ok now go to the folder where you have created the project just right click and open in terminal and for windows user you just need to click shift press shift and right click then it will say it will get a option of opening powershell ok once you have opened powershell just run the command npm in it ok it will ask you for the package name let us make it resume pdf that is perfect ok it will asking for entry point we are going to make the entry point index.js before doing anything let me make another folder docs here all of the html code or all of the pdl file will be located here at first let us design our resume by using by using raw html and bootstrap resume dot html go to get bootstrap dot com from here just click on documentation and scroll down here you can see starter template just copy this starter template and paste it in resume html ok in the place of hello world just write resume 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 maker ok open the folder double click to open with any browser in my case my default browser is google chrome so it is opening with google chrome i am going to write all the html and css to making this cv and styling if you do not want to write html and css and do not want to waste your time on it you can have the source code on the link in the description you just click here and copy all the html and paste it here and you are ready to go skip this part feel free to do it do it ok from here i am going to remove this header one in the place of header one i am going to write a div with a class of resume border shadow display flex align items center and another class of justify content center actually what does it mean when you have a write like this when you give a dot after dot whatever you write that will be your class name and by default it will give you a div inside a div we will have a class name of resume border shadow uh, after every dot there will be a class which you write shadow and do not worry about this dash it will not count as any div or any class just press tab it will give some classes inside a div here it is ok 
inside this div I am going to make another div with class name of box inside this box div we will have another div with left side display inline block and press tab inside display inline block we will have our profile image inside profile image div will have a, a will have a tag with name of img and press tab okay control shift i for rearranging your code previously i have uploaded a image in twitter we are going to use the link of this image i am not going to upload any image I am not going to upload any image manually, so we are just going to use the image, use the image link, so it will be more easier and if you want to upload to Node.js server, you can do that, it is, uh, it is very easy, I have shown you how to upload images using Node.js, just follow this tutorial and you are ready to go, okay. Okay, below this profile image, create one more div with class name of contact and ML2. This class is coming from boost up margin left to empty mean margin top to and press tab. Inside this div, we will have another div with class name of heading heading text dot text upper case this text upper case is coming from bootstrap it will it will make all of a text into a upper case contact okay next make a paragraph with a class name of para margin bottom on press tab uh, here i am going to make all the information 